So guys, welcome back to another one. And yeah, you already read the title, you already seen the thumbnail. So let's get straight into it. And guys, for today's video, we have, of course, another banger here because we are going to use Sigurd once again. So if you didn't know it already, I made a whole video about him yesterday when I used him in a full on human team with, of course, Chaos Archer Bon and LR Esknor. And honestly, he did some good damage. He buffed our units and he did his job. So if you don't know how Sigurd works, he actually counts as a demon too. So this is going to be really fun to try out. And I don't think anyone else has already tried it out. So what we are going to do today is, of course, we are going to use Sigurd with, of course, the DK Melly, because DK Melly is that guy. He has the dog in him, you know? So uh, what Sigurd does is actually pretty simple. So for his first attack, it is going to be an AoE. What it does is, with a level 1, inflicts damage equal to 120% of attack on all enemies, extort 15% attack and defense for 2 turns. So what extort does is it decreases the target's stats and increases his own stats by the same amount he decreased them at. Not only that, then we of course have his single target attack. So what a level 1 does is inflicts Amplify damage equal to 180% of attack on one enemy. What the Amplify does is damage dealt plus 30 per active buff on himself. And look at this, look at this, look at this. We have something beautiful with this passive here. So what this passive does is at the start of an ally's turn, for every enemy affected by stat decrease, so his AoE, the eff uh, effect applies an effect which increases attack stats of all allies by 10% for two turns, up to three times. In, in addition, the hero is also of a demon race. So we get just more basic stats, more attack stats, and that's going to be really, really insane. And then, of course, we have his holy relic, and his holy relic is actually pretty clutch. So what it does is, in PvP only, increases the hero's basic stats by 25% of that of the enemy with the highest CC at the start of the battle. And if you don't know it already, like, every single guy out there is already using a DK melee team or a Chaos Archer and if you don't know their CCs are pretty pretty high. So honestly I think this is going to be quite fun to try out and yeah with that being said guys if you like this sort of content of course consider liking consider subscribing it really helps out the channel and it honestly makes my day and with that being said guys I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day if you are still going to summon on the um, new Chaos Archer banner or even the Zelda's banner I wish you the best of luck and with that being said guys let's get on to our first match of today with this Sigurd and DK melee combo. So, for our first match of today, we are up against a human team, actually. Okay, we do out CC him, that is pretty huge. And we already got a level 2 stat decrease, that is huge. <laughs> so, first of all, let's do the, uh, let's extort them. Then, what we are gonna do is, of course, AoE. Because, with, of course, Sigurd's AoE, we apply some darkness from our Asterosa. And then we AoE, and you know what, just to be sure, let's do a single target attack from our Sigurd here. And then we also combine the Meliodas cards. He is using dodge food. No, I should have known, man, I should have known. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. The level 2 got got wasted, but ah, uh, no. Okay, not a, uh, that was not good. That was totally not good. But it is still fine. It is still fine. We get a level 3 single target attack out of this. Um, let's see. Okay, he's also using like the new, uh, new Holy Relic on her. I did not play up against another one. So this is the first time I'm playing up against her with her Holy Relic. So well, honestly, we should be fine. He is fo focusing Sigurd. Honestly, I kind of get it. Uh, Sigurd, come on, don't die on me. Don't die on me yet. And he is still alive. Okay, that's actually pretty huge. Um, yeah, let's AoE once again. Then we do a single target attack with our Asterosa, and then a level 3 single target attack. Next turn, we get our ultimate. Not only that, we should be unshackled, so we should do a lot more damage here. Let's see. Um, level 3 incoming, and there goes the Chaos Archer. Look at that damage. 570k. 570k. Damn, we also have our ultimate now. I think this is a guaranteed win. <laughs> <laughs> he's using an LR list. Okay, honestly, I don't know why. This is not only the first time that someone is using LR list in like PvP. Like in the video yesterday, someone... Uh, I, I think that was in the video yesterday. Someone else was using LR list too. Like, I don't know. Like, some people... I, I don't... Well, 
it says in her passive, right, that she's like a PvE only unit. So I, I don't know. I don't know why people are using her in PvP. But we should be fine. We have our ultimate. Yeah, we are. Look at that. He gives up. He gives up. Honestly, I get it. So with that being said, let's get on to our second match of today with this team. <laughs> so for our second match of today, we are up against a human team, actually. Okay, you know what? That's actually pretty interesting. He is going to go first. Okay, he is a spender. You, ca you can already see that. But that's fine, guys. That's fine. We do not care about it. Um... And let's see, okay, he's gonna do an AoE. We can cleanse that, so we should be relatively fine. That's gonna hurt. Ooh, that kind of hurts a lot. Damn, damn. Uh, let's see. He's actually using the team that I used like a couple of videos ago. I know, shameless plug. If you didn't check it out, go check it out. Uh, let's do, I'm sorry, that was my phone. Let's do an AoE first of all, because then we extort, of course. Then we are gonna single target attack and single target attack again with our Sigurd. I think that is the play here. Uh, okay, come on. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. And okay, that's not a lot of damage, but that's fine because in the next turn, if our Sigurd is still alive, we get the attack buffs. So that's actually what we want, right? And we also have a level 3 single target attack. That's gonna be huge. Uh, let's see. Okay, he goes for Estherosa. Unfortunately, he does not make it. And he does an AoE. I did not expect him to do an AoE right there, but that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We are still alive. We are still kicking. And okay, or DK Melly is also alive. That is pretty huge. Uh, what are we gonna do though? What are we gonna do? I think we do the level 1, level 2, level 3. I think that is the play we kind of have to make here. Okay, 46k damage. Okay. Then we do the level 3 AoE. And it's gonna is that gonna wipe him out? Yeah, it is. It is. Okay, 772k. Damn, that's a lot. In Ungeared also. This is Ungeared. We also have our ult. That is actually insane. <laughs> Sometimes I forget how good this uh, DK melee like actually is. That is massive. Damn. Just damn. Um yeah, let's do the ult. Let's, first of all, let's extort. Then let's do the ult, then let's do the AoE. And I think we win. Just like that. Actually pretty easy. Um, is DK Melly still on top? I think he is. <laughs> I still think he is on top. But yeah, with that being said, guys, honestly, like his, uh, it, it, well, his Escanor didn't do a lot of damage because he had a goddess in the back. I don't know why he had it, but sure. So yeah, with that being said, guys, let's get on to our third and our final match of the day with, of course, this Sigurd. So, for our third and our final match of the day, we are up against the OG Demon Team. Okay, okay, I see you, I see you. That is actually, honestly, that's pretty dope, that's pretty dope. You can't even hate on this team. Uh, well, you can, I'm just gonna hate it, but <laughs> you kind of actually have to respect it. Let's see, what is he gonna do? Honestly, it has been a while. Like, facing a Assault Mode Meliodas, what was the last time I faced an Assault Mode Meliodas? Like, literally like half a year ago, I think. I th yeah, I think like... I think like a half a year ago, damn, that, that... Ooh. He's also using his Holy Relic. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I'm sorry, I'm just gonna hate him, but... Like, he is so irrelevant that I don't even know what his Holy Relic does, but it does do a lot, I guess. I, I think he gives those buffs, right, if I'm correct? Uh, that is fine. What we are going to do is, of course, double A... Well, triple A, we actually. Yeah, I don't think he's using dodge food while he's out seeing me. Okay, so we in, uh, inflicted some darkness there. We inflict some darkness more. Then also some more darkness, of course. And look at all those damage numbers. That is huge. Now we kind of have to wait. Honestly, yeah. I, I, I think we win this. Just, just because we have DK Melly. That's like the only reason we actually win this. Well, also also the Esterosa, I guess. Because the Esterosa applies some darkness, right? And yeah, the more AoEs we have, the more damage we essentially do, I guess. Um, ooh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. That doesn't look too great for our DK Melee. Come on, can he still live? 424k? 400 and... Damn, damn. <laughs> I did not expect that. <laughs> <What? laughs> nah, no, you can't be serious with that. 
You can't be serious. There is no actual way that ju that that just happened. There is no actual way. That is a lot of damage. Okay, 117k with a single target attack on Sigurd. That is also pretty massive. And okay, DK is still alive. Can or can or DK do it? Come on. He he does do it. He does do it. Okay, huge. That is also pretty huge. He has Gloxini in the back. Okay. Okay, he has Glox in the back. I don't know why, but I am kind of scared. So. He's gonna do a level 2 AoE. That takes out or Estarosa. Okay, if our DK survives, we win, I think. Can we get some... Can we get some single target attacks? J j just some good... Uh what is this AoE? <laughs> what is this RNG, I mean? Okay, I think we lost this. But honestly, I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. Because I have a lot of respect for this guy. He's using Assault Mode Melis. Honestly, it is fine. We did lose. But I, I will give it to him. Like, I did not expect to, to go up against this team. Like... You know, ironically, I'm kind of shocked. Still, Sigurd is pretty good. Don't forget that. But yeah, you have to respect this. You have to respect this guy. But yeah, with that being said, guys, if you like this sort of content, of course, consider liking, consider subscribing. And I will see you all, of course, tomorrow. And of course, have an awesome rest of your day.